For this Challenger 3 installation, the customer has run a two inch copper pipe from his compressor location out back of the shop into the production area. This copper pipe is formed in a loop configuration, which means that the customer has run a single pipe out into the production area and then teed off and run kind of a square or rectangle around the production area. Using a loop configuration, it allows the compressed air to travel in two directions. If you were to run a single line and have three, four machines feeding off that single line, the first machine would benefit from a good, constant air supply, whereas the last machine would be air starved because it is the last in line. A loop eliminates that problem. It's very important to have your plumber do the correct calculations prior to installing your equipment and your airline. Different models of MNR machinery consume different volumes of air, what we call CFM, cubic feet per minute. In this case, the Challenger 3 consumes approximately 22 CFM. However, the customer has two additional presses in this building for a grand total of 56 CFM. The compressor that he's purchased has an output of about 70 CFM, so he's got a little extra. But the calculations of the piping and the length of the run are very important. You have to have the correct diameter of pipe in order to get the correct amount of volume to the presses. If the presses are starved for air, they won't work well.